Terminal tabs in VS Code let you view and manage all of your integrated terminals. Now here, for example, I've created a few terminal instances, and you can see that the terminal tabs are going to be displayed by default over on the right-hand side of the terminals. So in this first terminal group, for example, I have Python running, so that is the terminal over here, then a normal shell prompt running over here, and you can see that Python is highlighting, telling me that that is my currently active terminal. When I start clicking around, though, that highlighting will update, just based on whatever my active terminal is. Now, if I want to switch to one of these other terminal groups, I can go down here and click on the node terminal, for example. So here, this one's running node. Then I can switch into this other terminal group, which again has two terminals in it, a normal shell prompt one over here, and then a one that's running uh, top over here as well. So I get this nice overview of all of my open uh, integrated terminals in VS Code. Now I can also use terminal tabs to start creating new terminals and managing my existing terminals as well. So let's switch back to this first editor group and say that I want to create a new terminal. I can just go and click on the little split icon over here to split one of the existing terminals. And now I have three terminals in this first group. So the Python one and then two shell terminals. And I can just run a command here. Once I want to get rid of one of these terminals, let's say I don't need one anymore, I can again go over to my terminal tabs, click on the little trash can icon, and it'll go and delete that terminal. Now, if I want to create an entirely new terminal in its own group, I can also click on the little plus icon over here. You can see it's created a new terminal down here in its own group. I can also go to the little drop down to create a more specific type of terminal, such as bash. Now, the final thing we'll take a look at is that you can also drag and drop terminals around to actually manage them. So let's go to the node terminal down here, and let's say I wanted to move it into my first terminal group along with Python and my shell here. I can just go and uh, click and drag on the node terminal over here in my tabs, go up to the first terminal group, and then drop it into the location where I want it to be. So if I want it to be in the middle, I can just drop it there. And you can see that I was able to go and reposition that terminal so it's now in the first terminal group here. And again, I could also drag the Python terminal down here into its own group if I wanted to. So now I've gone and moved the uh, Python terminal into its own isolated terminal instead of being in that first terminal group. So that's just a quick introduction to terminal tabs in VS Code. They're really helpful for seeing what you have open and for also managing your terminals as well.